Hey guys, what's up? We're back with more small town reviews. Today, me and Sven are gonna look at some casino reviews. <laughs> we haven't looked at the local casinos yet, so uh, I found some real bangers. Sven has not seen these, and let's flipping go, guy. <laughs> Guys, before we get started, I wanna mention that the second half of my tour, the dates and times have been announced. Finally, they're out. Check the links in the description down below. I'm going all over America right now, doing some stand-up comedy and music and stuff too, so we've been selling out a lot of the live show stuff locations please come see me at the show i'll meet you after the show and it'll be a splendid ass time so the link to those tickets are in the description i don't think splendid and ass are supposed to go together that is that's how god intended <laughs> also if you haven't seen it yet go check out the comedy central originals youtube channel i stopped by their offices a few weeks ago and we shot a bunch of like sketches and i appeared on some of their shows and stuff shot a whole bunch of fun stuff my favorites are like the piss boy sketch alibi ambulance and the movie quotes addiction guy there's a lot of good stuff there so go ahead show them some love i had a great time subscribe to comedy central's original youtube channel and we'll see more gus content in the future <laughs> all right so without further ado let's look let's at some get into it <laughs> Why would you my, my first contribution is it's cutting me off all right so now we're taking a look at some public google reviews left at casinos so this review comes from Finn, and Finn says, One star, outdoor theater is okay, but rooms are dirty. The mirror was noticeably not wiped down, gross stains on some chairs in my room. Everywhere is freezing cold except for the food, which will burn you. <laughs> what? You have control of the temperature of your room in a hotel. Well, and also the food. Like, <laughs> Look out, guys, unavoidable burns. There's just food sitting everywhere. <laughs> Wait, look at what else he says. The coffee is so hot that the next day I still have burns in my mouth. On top of that, it is basically brown hot water. <laughs> I ordered oatmeal at the diner so hot I had to wait 20 minutes just to eat it, which I still got burns from. <laughs> It just keeps getting burned by everything. <laughs> Next one is from Jack, a local guide. He says, One star. They used to be my favorite casino. We didn't have a minute of fun the last two trips. The machines were horribly... T Right? Yeah, that's people keep saying the machines are tight if they don't play if they don't pay out a lot. Oh, know? okay. The machines were horribly tight. The new buffet was a disappointment. Buffet, please take note. When a waitress spills a full glass of milk <laughs> on a customer and their food, have the waitress comp the meal. It happened to me, and all I got was <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Can you imagine? The waitress just came and spilled this entire dude's meal on him. It just says sorry. Sorry. <laughs> McKinley said, one star. Honestly wish they let me win more than $1,500 every six months. <laughs> this is a business. Like, yeah, they can't just shell out money to everyone. That's what I love about most of these reviews, though, frankly, is I was sorting through hundreds of people that were just saying, like, I lost money, bad review. It's like, you that's know. A casino. That's what happens at the casino. You lose mm. money. Okay, Stefan says, with one star, really bad internet, food is good, gambling. <laughs> Gambling house does the best, but mainly lousy internet. Who's going to the casino to use the <laughs> internet? All right, right here, Jane says, one star. It was miserable. They let people pick their nose and <laughs> use buffet <laughs> handles. Gross! I don't think they're letting people do yeah. that. They're just doing that and getting away with it. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> they got a, an anti-nose picker standing at other casinos in front of their buffets. Like, hey, right. <laughs> can't be doing that, man. Okay, Robert gives it one star and says, do not go there if you cannot afford to. It can and will destroy your life. Oh. oh, this is sad. Robert, we... <laughs> Gambling destroyed his life. Also, though, it's like that you went in there. <laughs> they didn't make you go in there. That's so many of these people. Again, I get it. Like gambling is an addiction. It's unhealthy and stuff. But people are so peeved that they're rating the casinos poorly because they're like, yeah. I couldn't afford rent this month. One star. It's like you made that choice. You are the one star. You are the. Whoa. <laughs> okay. William says one star. Slow check in. Vomit all over the <laughs> stairs for hours and rooms that smell of smoke. Smoke, sleep in your car or a box, you'll be better <laughs> off. Ooh, Thor gives this one one star and says, <laughs> Tobissy? <laughs> T-O-T-O-Bissy? That's like the guy in Rudolph, the Bissy, Bissy. 
pissy, pissy. <laughs> Too pissy and waited in line just to play a game because of renovations. There was also, I saw, I was looking at a casino in Florida that had a hurricane hit it and there were dozens of reviews that were like, this is BS, casino closed cause hurricane. <laughs> it's like, don't go, save your house. John says one star, not good. They took too much money. Sons of bitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he was trying to say sons of bitches, but nothing just went right there. Maybe he's saying the sons of bitch. Oh, because uh, oh, it's in Florida. That's, boom, he's <laughs> next level IQ. All right, David. Ooh, well, he's got like a verified star yeah. or something by his name. <laughs> so he knows what he's talking this, about. This is the David. David gives it one star and says, Do not gamble here expecting to win. The buffet is terrible now, and I had to go straight to the bathroom before I finished eating. He kept eating. <laughs> <laughs> so he had to like throw it up or something. I'm sorry if you got food poisoning, David. All right, so this guy's name is Psycho, but he spelled it wrong. <laughs> but here's what I love. Not even just in his name, but in his custom-made profile picture. Oh, no. It says Fisco. Fisco. <laughs> so Fis Fisco Fisco says, one star, worst experience ever. I called the front desk for a blanket and I got a pice or cloth that's as thick and as hard as a brick. <laughs> pice or cloth. <laughs> pice, uh, pice or cloth. That is a little bit dramatic there. All right. Gene gets... <laughs> <laughs> well... Jean lost her butt. <laughs> lost my butt. Three sobbing emojis. <laughs> yeah, how does the staff improve on them? <laughs> so Jeb Bush <laughs> says one star. <laughs> stupid with two O's. All right, so this next casino that we looked at is a place called Victory Land. I think it's in Alabama. And I saw dozens of customers complaining that they have door personnel that are, like, trying to impose dress codes on people. What? Like, dozens of women commented, like, I tried going in with a spaghetti strap, and they refused to let me in because of my dress code. What the Why? hell? Victoryland Casino in Alabama. Don't go raid them, but what the hell, Victoryland? <laughs> it's a casino. You're like, okay, do you want to come in and smoke all day and destroy your life, <laughs> but don't show titties? <laughs> <laughs> all right, so Nick Carlson says, one star. The dealers look mean, especially the woman dealers. I was walking off the boat. Oh, this casino's on a boat. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't mention this is a boat casino in Florida. I was walking off the boat and one of the staff just snatched the drink out my hand that I purchased on the boat and said, you can't take that out. So rude. You can't just walk out with the dishes. In public too, just walking yeah. out <laughs> drinking in public. What the hell, man? All right, Jasmine gives it one star and says, I did not like it. I was at the bar next to the poker room. No one what? was sitting next, next to me. me. This is hard to read. I was watching videos on Facebook, waiting for my boyfriend, and one of the bartender came to me asking me to lower the volume of my phone. I think she did not like that I was watching videos on Spanish. <laughs> Why are you watching full volume videos at a bar in the first place? Dude, that's the biggest takeaway here. Is like, if you're that person, screw you. Like, that is the rudest shit in the entire world. <laughs> what the hell? And then she makes it about Spanish. I know, it's because it was on Spanish. Yeah, I can't understand. Oh. All right, so Diego, a local guide, says, uh, one star, although they said I needed my original birth certificate to be employed here, although I am a U.S. citizen and have everything else valid, I still could not get paid $10 per hour job here. But all the others, they said, yes, it's a biased employment process, but I will still gamble myself some moolah, and yes, I will vote. <laughs> vote. It's like, I'll show them. I'm going to gamble my moolah and vote. <laughs> I'm voting. Screw you guys. This one is this one is very hard to read. Oh, God. Okay, Eli says, one star. I visit this place four, 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 five. five times. Left over $1,400. No wins, no payback, only one-way ticket. Put the money, go home empty, stay away. Keep your money, go to Hard Rock Casino, they more far paying back some. <laughs> what is this? I don't even know what this is. This is like a fever dream trying to read this. Dude, I, this is so weird. It's it's kind of sad when you think about it because like clearly like these people just like they're not very literate at all. But there are so many reviews where somebody got so bothered by something that they went home and they typed up a review and it's like, how could anyone understand what this is? It's in, it's insane. And also, I see so many people. This is probably an older guy. I always see so many older people like putting the dot dot dots 
It's like <laughs> the dot 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 since forever has always meant like suspense. Yeah, you know? like you, you're waiting. Like so, he wants it to read: no wins, no payback, only one way ticket. Dot dot dot. Put the money. Go home empty. <laughs> well, this is a bigger suspense. Stay away. Keep your money. Go to Hard Rock Casino. Stay more far, paying back some. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Is he threatening somebody? <laughs> this one's from Shirley. <laughs> <laughs> Shirley just says, one star, can't win. Poop. <laughs> That's the whole thing. Sorry, Shirley. Okay, Lois says, one star, no thanks. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks. Thanks for the... <laughs> That's the whole thing. Lois, thanks for the what? <laughs> I'm in suspense. Dot, dot, dot on that one. So this one's from Chucky. <laughs> He's got a Chucky oh, profile no. picture. Chucky says one star, stinky place. <laughs> <laughs> Where players speak Spanish while the poker game stills on and the floor manager nor the dealers does anything about it. I hope the gaming commission... Take some action about it. I don't understand one word of what they're humbling about. This is United States. The official language is English. I feel discriminated oh, on my on. own country. What? You're the one who's discriminated. This dude, this Chucky. This is nuts. Thank you, Chucky. <laughs> I probably shouldn't. Yeah, this guy's going to find me and kill me totally. <laughs> All right, Miami says, I got injuries on one of my visits. <laughs> wow. How do you get injured in a casino? <laughs> Look, here's why I love two people like that. Like, I know, like like, me too! That, that you know what? Two helpful reviews here. Attack Pro 123 said Dubai, <laughs> and it's got two helpful thumbs up. Where was this casino? Probably Dubai. Okay, that makes sense. That's called a context clue. All right, Roberto gives it one star and says, They take your money. Don't perturb your money. Don't go bad, nasty <laughs> casino. <laughs> I don't get it. Is that the name of the casino? I, hopefully. <laughs> All right, Shaw said one star, gar away. I don't know what that means, Good. but thanks, Shaw. He's a local guy. He's left 340 Jeez. reviews and posted 825, 825 photos. photos. And to cap it all off, we've got this beautiful little review. Okay. Okay, so Larna says one star. That's it. That's Just it. nothing. Nothing <laughs> else. response from the owner. Larna, thank you for your rating. <laughs> thank you, Larna. This was helpful, Larna. Oh, dude, I love it so much because so many of these casinos, especially the smaller ones, like the owners will go in and they'll try to respond to people to try to like, you know, the PR, customer service kind of stuff. But they're all idiots. They're all idiots. And the casinos are responding to like the dumbest ones, you know, will be like, can't win money, can't go in coffee, too expensive. Stinky house, take my money. Yeah, and they'll be like, hey, crotch shot, one, two, three. So sorry about your experience here. <laughs> And then they'll, like, direct them to surveys. What I love, too, is, like, sometimes the people that are grumpy fight back and forth with the <laughs> casinos. Like, they're too bad. I was still charged a dollar fifty for coffee. So that's what we got for Small Town Casino Reviews. If you guys like this series, we have a lot of fun making it. Please let me know in the comments, and we'll definitely do some more. We got a lot of other businesses cooked up that we found some good <laughs> material for. But, yeah, I don't often ask, like, do you want to see more of this? But do you want to? We like making this, and it's pretty fun. <laughs> but that's it for today's Small Town Reviews. Make sure you grab your tickets to the live show stuff in the description. Go check out our weekly podcast, the Gus and Eddie Podcast. And where can people find you? Uh, YouTube, just type in Sven Johnson. I'm the one of the guy like this. And then Twitter, I'm just Swembo2000. Okay. It's a voice video. Voice Go, video. Voice, voice video. Surprise video. Me. Here's the video. outro music. <laughs> I failed to see you there. Listen here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here to tell you today about our wonderful sponsor. That sponsor is Honey. Thank you, Honey, for sponsoring this video. So if you don't know, Honey's this really cool browser extension. It's completely... Uh, it's completely free to download, and it's an extension that automatically finds the best promo and coupon codes for you when you are online shopping. All right. Guys, here's the thing. With all these ad reads, there's a couple things that you just have to say to include in the ad read. Let me just tell you something that I do not have to say. Honey is the easiest company to do ad stuff for because I use it all the time. Here's the thing. When Eddie and I were buying the stuff for the podcast set, all the cameras, the backdrop, all that equipment and stuff, I had Honey on my computer. It takes two clicks to install it 
And just by having this free Chrome extension, we saved hundreds and hundreds of dollars just by having Honey. They didn't make me say that, that is the actual truth. You can do all sorts of cool stuff with Honey and it works on over 37,000 different websites. Websites like Amazon, Walmart, all the big good boy ones. A feature that I've used a bunch before on Honey is the waitlist option. If you see something, like maybe you're browsing on Amazon, you're like, damn, that monitor looks dope as hell. That's exactly what I did. But I'm like, whoa, I don't want to pay that listed price for it. Let me just click waitlist and if it drops below this certain amount of money that I set, then Honey will just let me know and be like, yo dog, that monitor's cheap as hell. And then you save even more money with the promo codes. All right, here's some good stuff that I gotta tell you. Honey is so easy to install, it takes two clicks. You don't have to pay for it, it is free. There are millions and millions of people using Honey. It's just this tiny little icon that sits up here in the corner of your browser and when you're shopping and stuff, you just get notifications. It's like, dog, we found some coupons. How'd you like to save this money? This is the no brainer, guys. There's like literally no reason not to download Honey, okay? You know me. I'm scrounging around for deals all the time. I'm wearing $5 Goodwill shoes, okay? I'm a stretcher of the dollar. Please go click the link in the description down below to install Honey on your browser right now. It helps me out. It costs you nothing. It takes five seconds, and I guarantee you it's going to save you lots of money over the next few years. You guys want to see how easy it is to install Honey? Well, look at this. Sabrina, hit him with the video. <laughs> click it around. Here we go. Ticket, 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 ticket. Ka-ching, bam Bitch, we got Honey on our computer. <laughs> guys, I don't know what to tell you. Check out the link in the description and save some dang money today. Day, okay, it helps everybody out including yours truly and yours Yuli. So get the hell out of my face and get honey you son of a bitch